Macho Man, Randy Savage! Triple We're going to witness an explosion for the vacant championship, and it's happening next. It's Bray Wyatt taking on three of the toughest competitors the WWE has to offer. Oh, I can't wait for this one. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it's for the WWE Hardcore Championship. Making his way to the ring, representing the Wyatt family, weighing in at 285 pounds, Bray Wyatt. Here comes Bray Wyatt, the leader of the disturbing Wyatt family. Did you say disturbing? Come on, the Wyatt family is flat out certifiable. We finally fill the void here tonight. But which one of these competitors will we be calling champion? His opponent, first, from Sarasota, Florida, weighing in at 237 pounds, Macho Man Randy Savage. The legend Randy Savage is here. Oh, yeah. When you see the Macho Man, you're looking at one of the greatest of all time. One must be going through the competitors' minds, knowing that when this one's over, one of them will be the new champion. It's going to be interesting to see what alliances temporarily form in this one. Yeah, temporary is the uh, key word there. Sounds like this Baltimore crowd has already picked who they want in this matchup.
55 pounds, Triple H. Just listen to this capacity crowd on their feet and ready for fatal four-way action. Oh, who doesn't love a great fatal four-way match? Folks, we are guaranteed a new champion when this one's over here tonight. So it has all come to this. And in a few minutes, we will have a new champion. And there's the bell. Time to see if Bray Wyatt can still eat worlds or if he's going to be the one who gets devoured. Yeah, these Fatal 4-Ways are crowd favorites for a reason. In the Fatal 4-Way, you take the advantage wherever you can find it. So here we are. A vacant championship to be filled and the very fabric of the WWE possibly changing very dramatically. He's simply reminding him that he's here. What do you believe Braun Strowman is thinking about? Look at this. Usually these two are standing in the corner together, not on the opposite sides of the ring, ready to lock up against one another. How would you approach a matchup like this if you were him? Brothers fight, sisters fight, teammates fight. That's just the way it is. In the end, I'm sure everybody's going to hug it out and move on. Oh, Michael, are you serious? Deep down, this is probably what they need. On any other night of the week, they're standing side by side. But tonight, we see who the stronger member of the team really is. For some competitors, part of their strategy is to demean their opponent. That, a move like that says it all. Yeah, you're just trying to embarrass somebody now. Oh, no! Talk about getting launched out of the ring! He's inflicting some serious pain here. The game starting to fade. In four-way matches such as this, things could get very ugly for him very quickly. I'm not concerned. I don't think I've ever seen him look more motivated than he looked heading into this match. Well said, John. And now's the time for one of these guys to take hold of this match. I'm not sure if I've ever experienced an eerie silence that falls over an entire arena like I do when Bray Wyatt announces he's here. Even in darkness, you can see the whites of people's eyes and the audience fixated on Bray Wyatt and frightened beyond explanation at what he's going to do. Leaving the ring here may change the entire complexion of this match. Yeah, and if their face hits this floor, it'll change the complexion for sure. Just look at this. You can see the results from that move. Well, well, well. That's the first time tonight we've seen that move. I wouldn't mind seeing it a little more often. Well, out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation, and you can find yourself in a world of hurt. You know, I've been in a lot of arenas, and I've seen a lot of things, but I've never seen a capacity crowd stand with such a combination of fear and awe as when Bray Wyatt begins his ominous walk to the ring. Oh, I think this man means business. What type of competitor is favored when you step outside the ropes, King? Well, in my opinion, the more vicious, the more destructive person that's willing to do absolutely anything to hurt his opponent, regardless of the consequences, he has the advantage. 
Now, why did he do that? A move like that's low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees the belt, he likes to hit below it. I think you can tell by looking into the disturbing eyes of Brick. And the Macho Man's reeling in pain. Oh, yeah. Things don't look good right now for Randy Savage. Man, oh, man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. Nice reversal. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. He's too busy bragging and boasting and battling in this matchup. Extra slow getting back to his base here. What does Braun Strowman need to do now to remain a factor in this match? Guys, he's going to have to turn things around quickly if he wants to win this thing. You know, I can't seem to figure this guy out. He, my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. Not a lot of spring left in his step right now. You can see him struggling to stand after all the damage he's taken. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. Bray Wyatt on the defensive. It'll be interesting to see how he responds here in this four-way environment. And at this point, it looks to me like this match is as even as it could get. I think a lot of people would agree with that assessment, John. For his sake, I hope there's a lot more left in the tank. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Back in the ring again. Triple H knows how to polish off an opponent. It looks like that back is under a great deal of stress right now. He's got the shoulders down, Cole. This could be it. How much damage did that do? A lot from the looks of it. I think no one is surprised. Triple H is feeling the abuse that has been dealt out this match so far. I mean, it looks to me like he's almost completely out. From what I said, they both appear to be competing with the same amount. He could pin his opponent right here. I think this is it. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way over here. This should do it right there. I think this thing's over. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Really pushing his opponent to the limit here. Oh, he missed. Oh, nobody home that time. Somehow. Oh, it looks like he's in no man's land here. He needs to be able to put things back together here. Michael, this is a dangerous position to be in. He needs to be able to find a way to clear the complete counter. Good Lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far. Look at that, it's locked in. You can practically feel the wear and tear that's been done throughout this match. Whoa! Would you look at this? Can you believe it? This is an undying will to succeed. And Strowman sees it coming. He got out of the way. Uh-oh, things could get real interesting out here. It's always interesting when they battle outside the ring. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. When he gets going like this, there are a few better. He's bringing it back inside the ring now. I can't blame him. Keep it in the ring. Uh-oh, 
now. Looks like this one's going out to the floor. What was your first clip? Put out the laundry because the clothesline is here. Oh, man, that almost took their head off. Oh, did you see the head whip back? Oh, no. Not again. Please, not again. You have to wonder how much use of that arm he'll have as this match continues. Boy, he is really tired now. That tank of his has to be reading empty. It has to be, King. But I still don't see him giving up. Action outside. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? A knockdown drag out brawl, complete with a big stunt. Man, these guys are throwing bombs up, pulling out all the stops. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Uh, going to the top, high risk. Nice move. And a dangerous move. You don't see that move every day. Oh, man, is he fired up. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, no! Bringing it back into the ring. It looks like we're going to see what kind of pain they can inflict out here on the floor. And that was a huge counter. He was one step ahead on that one. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. I don't want to know what that feels like. Yeah, well, I've felt it before. He's going for the pin. This could be it. I think he's got him. And he's heading back in. I can't blame him. He wasted too much time on that one. Off the top rope. And will this be it? It may be. Two. When he gets going like this, there are few better. There he goes. Crashing to the floor. Oh, man. Crashing and burning. Treble X. He's gone where he wants him. How are these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? Get his shoulders are down. One. Two. Now back to the ring. There's your favorite. Twitter. Here's your winner, representing D Generation X, Triple H. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. You know, I don't recall ever actually being pinned, but you have to think it's pretty humiliating. And for three of these competitors, that is not how they drew this one up. Ray Dudley, Devon Dudley, King. Jim, the Anvil.
Up next, we'll see two teams who are on a collision course, and it's happening right here. Oh, my gosh. Who's going to win this? It'll be the Dudley boys versus Team Kane. Two evenly matched teams. I don't know who to pick. tag team match is going to be one for the record books. They've been buzzing about this one ever since this match was announced. to commit yet another demonic deed here tonight. Yeah, just as long as he stays in the ring and doesn't come anywhere near us, I'll be fine. You'd be hard-pressed to find a better tag team match than we're about to see here. match on social media trending worldwide under the hashtag WWE tag match. Yeah, I'm looking at my right... Cole, wait a minute. You unfriended me. Oh, man. I'm really looking forward to this tag team match. Underway here, the Big Red Monster looks to get things off to a painful start for the opposition. Well, I know one thing for certain. We're going to get our money's worth in this one. These tag team matches never fail to deliver, and this should be no exception. All I know is Kane is here, and some serious attitude usually comes along with him. Oh, I can't wait. Let's touch on Kane a bit. In a tag team, being a good partner is as important as anything else. How can he do his part tonight in this one? I've been in the ring with Kane and can tell you that it's no picnic. Now you add a partner to it and it's got to be a complete nightmare. Kane is like a force of nature. Striking with the axe handle. Really going to town right now. 
head and then the back drop. Great move. Oh, what height on that back drop. That's a hard landing from that height. But Ray Dudley is not someone to sleep on. It's come down to a battle of attrition right now. Yeah, it can really go either way at this point. Man, what a struggle. And here's Devon Dudley in full control. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. He's inflicting some serious pain here. to the floor. Oh, well, time delivery by Devon Dudley. What a crushing blow to the ribs. That's a first. What a move. Definitely sets a tone for the evening. I like it. You don't see that move every day. This man means business. The small of the back is absorbing a great deal of punishment here. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. He's starting to feel it here. And you have to assume his partner is just itching to get in there right about now. And, Michael, this might very well be where one of these guys pulls away from the other. Oh, it's been a great matchup to this point, And this could really go either way. Yeah. Neckbreaker. So devastating. Kane going to work now. Devon Dudley is being outworked here tonight. Where do you think he should go from here? This tag team match is dangerously close to getting out of control for him. You said it, Michael. He's going to need to mount an offensive fast if he wants to stay in this thing. You know, this match can still go either way. It's just too early to call it. This kind of offense he's known for. Yeah, you're right about that. He's made a name for himself with this. He's having a seriously hard time getting back to his feet after that. Well, that's the first time we've seen that move tonight from either locker room. I kind of love it. And Kane going... And he kicks out. And he lives to fight again. Now bringing in his partner. A shining example of teamwork as they hit the double team. Here's a cover. Two. Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. Boy, he just got laid out. Expanding the repertoire with that move. Nothing to laugh about here for the Anvil. Headed into this match, he and his partner look extremely confident. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Well, it's hard to argue that. But I'd say this one could go either way. He's showing no signs of letting up. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. What's this, Michael? Uh-oh. He 
he's in position, ready to strike. When he gets going like this, there are few better. The shoulders are down. And the shoulders come up after that pinfall attempt. I don't believe it. He refuses to lose. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way over here. <laughs> this is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. Oh, my. He's wild in there. He's making a statement here with this attack. Look at Devon Dudley here. Taking on some moderate offense here. Going to need to start playing a little better defense. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back, and I love it. And he gets the tag. <laughs> hey, Cole, this could do it. I think so. There's Bubba Ray with a little smack talk. <laughs> Bubba Ray can talk smack with the best of them. Looking to steal one there, perhaps. Yeah, I think it's way too early in the match for that to work. And that one hurt his hand. He took too much time, and boy, did he pay the price. Watch out! One move after the other. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. In comes Kane. Ooh, that was stiff. Look out below. Gonna have to shake off the moderate damage that's been inflicted here and find a way to maintain the upper hand. Kane is all business here. We've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. And it's Kane executing the reversal. You don't see that move every day. We'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. This has been a great matchup. You're right about that, Cole. A Matt Classic. We're seeing it all on the side on the back. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Devon Dudley gets the tag. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. He's stumbling some now. 
His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. You got that right, Michael. This is where we find out exactly what this guy's made of. He's been incredibly aggressive all night, Cole. But sometimes you can be too aggressive. Let's see if that becomes... We got a call. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. I can't believe it. He just won't go away. In off the tag is Jim the Anvil Nighthawk. What's the next move for Kane to turn things around quickly to remain in this thing? This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. You said it, Michael. He's going to need to mount an offensive fast if he wants to stay in this thing. To show this, what a counter. And that was a huge counter. Reversal. Oh, gosh. There's no telling how much damage that did. Look at Jim the Anvil Nighthawk here. transpired this far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Yeah. I can't believe everything that's transpired this far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. Will it be? Just trying to goad his opponent into making a mistake here. Well, I've never seen him do that before. He's in a very bad way here, guys. But with all due respect, I think we could be seeing the end for Bubba Ray Dudley. Jim the Anvil Nighthawk is looking at this right now. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh, this is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whenever you get hit like that, for the next 15 minutes, everybody you see has an exact win. King, just look at this man. He's all business. And that's the way he has to be if he wants to win here tonight. the power of this guy. Scoop. They should do it right there. I think this thing's over. Two. Now that's an impressive tag team victory. Here are your winners, Kane and Jim, the Anvil Nighthawk. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to everyone. I love tag team matches, and that was one of the best I've seen in a while. I can assure you that this is not how Bubba Ray Dudley envisioned this one going. Yeah, you can bet they're going to be talking about this match for quite some time.
This is going to be very interesting. Stay with us. The fatal four-way match is next. It'll be Razor Ramon against three of WWE's toughest competitors. I don't know if we've ever seen something like this before. The following Fatal 4-Way Contest is a table match. Making his way to the ring from Miami, Florida. Weighing in at 270 pounds, Razor Ramon. You know, tables matches really require a competitor to have eyes in the back of his head. You can never lose sight of where the nearest table is located. Truthfully, I'm good with any Survivor Series match. That doesn't include four doinks. <laughs> what was that all about anyway? Wasn't one doink enough? You know, guys, with matchups like this, it's no wonder the WWE has the longest-running episodic television show in history. Yeah, matchups like these and the King don't change that channel. This match is sure to be an instant classic. From St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. Just listen to this capacity crowd on their feet and ready for fatal four-way action. Oh, who doesn't love a great fatal four-way match? Truthfully, I'm good with any Survivor Series match that doesn't include four doinks. <laughs> what was that all about anyway? Wasn't one doink enough? Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 200. 
266 pounds, Kevin Owens. The man has made his way up from NXT to become the upper echelon of the WWE locker room. Kevin Owens looks ready to go. You know, I'd pick a winner, but I only have a 25% chance of getting it right. And I don't like those odds. Here we go. And in this one, it's all legal. The only stipulation, put one of your three opponents through a table. You're right. And in a fatal four-way, each second could be your last. Should see some interesting pairings here. But hey, I have a feeling the WWE Universe is in for a treat tonight. Bringing it back between the ropes. And that's a good thing. Kevin Owens shows us some clever offense here. Let's take a moment to talk about Kevin Owens. How did she come out on top in this fatal four-way? Obviously a talented competitor, Michael. But in a match like this, sometimes it comes down to luck. Not all the time, of course, but sometimes. Oh, yeah. He's got his hands full, all right. Wow. Getting back into the ring now. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. Ow! They hit him with the table! Oh my, get the medics down here! What an offensive show by Randy Orton. Oh, with the table! And that table being swung like a weapon once again! Oh, not again, not again! Back in the ring again. Here we go. Back inside the ring. Looks like Randy Orton has broken a sweat. He needs to make sure he doesn't get double or even triple teamed here. But it's important to know that this match has been so evenly contested so far. You really can't pick a winner. Well said, John. And now's the time for one of these guys to take hold of this match. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. He's inflicting some serious pain here. I like what I'm seeing here from Randy Orton. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Oh, what impact. That just brought him crashing to the canvas with thunderous authority. Man, that was some slam. Oh, and the reversal by Vader. You know what's always depressed me so much about Randy Orton, whether it's when I was in the ring with him or watching him from right here at the announce table, was his quick strike capability. The Viper nickname is perfect for Randy because he strikes so fast. A lot of times, you never even see it coming. All this action outside the ring, real dangerous out here. It looks like we're going to see what kind of pain they can inflict out here on the floor. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. Super quick striking ability of the Apex Predator is lethal, King, but we can't take anything away from Orton's size and strength either. Randy's got plenty of power to go along with that speed. And that's why the Viper is such an expert at reversing moves on an opponent. It's that deadly combination of quickness and strength. Nobody is better at catching you off guard and landing a huge attack than Randy Orton. He sees it! Woo, a little showboating going on here. It's got to be hard to rebound from that one. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. He's showing no signs of letting up. Oh, boy. The 
stomps are starting. The question is, will the stomps ever stop? Stop it away. Oh. Action outside. How will these guys do with absorbing the punishment they're about to receive out here? Razor Ramon showing us how to get it done. It looks like we're going to see what kind of pain they can inflict out here on the floor. Nobody home there. Nobody home? Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months. The ring may not be big enough for what's about to unfold here. Are you kidding me? This entire arena may not be big enough. He's setting up a decisive victory for Randy Orton. Incredible. Here's your winner, the Viper, Randy Orton. Nice win here in this fatal four-way match. Talk about making your presence felt in a match. Wow, what a win. As we put the bow on this match, I can't help but think that was one of the most exciting tables matches I've seen in years. The American Dream, Dusty Rhodes. Tatsumi Fujinami. Big E. The Big Show. Coming up next, right here, you'll see six of the biggest names in WWE square off. Man, this is going to be awesome. We have Dusty Rhodes taking on all comers. I'm going to tell you something. I don't know who to pick in this battle. The following six-man contest is a battle royal, making his way to the ring from Austin, Texas. Weighing in at 275 pounds, the American Dream, Dusty Rhodes. Here comes the American Dream. Big match for him here tonight. making his way to the ring, and King, you can bet this one's going to be intense. Well, don't let JBL's net worth fool you, folks. He's as rough and rugged as they come. A big match for him here tonight. Let's see if he's up for the challenge.
227 pounds, Tatsumi Fujinami. Here comes Tatsumi Fujinami. Oh, this is a fun to watch young man. Oh, the look on this guy's face tells me he's about to inflict some major pain. Whew, you better look out. From Newcastle upon Tyne, weighing in at 194 pounds, Neville! Big match up here tonight, and this arena is electric. Oh, man, you can feel this crowd. Oh, I've been looking forward to this one for a long time. Representing the New Day from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 285 pounds, one half of the WWE Tag Team Champions, Big E. King, just take a look at the immense size of Big E. Yeah, Big E has muscles in places most people don't even have places. We're just moments away from what promises to be another great match. From Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 440 pounds, The Big Show! Just listen to this crowd. They're going through the roof for this six-man matchup. Who can blame them? This is awesome. The WWE Universe on its feet, looking forward to this great match. You see that? That's a flame from the fire-breathing dragon known as Kutsumi Fujinami coming right at you. You're right. And in the Battle Royal, anything can happen. And you know what? It usually does. Well, partner, we've got six superstars and about a million possibilities about how this will go. And you know, it's just amazing to me that this is just another night in the WWE. Always memorable. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. You know, Tatsumi Fujinami's skills aside, what do you think his next move should be? He's one superstar who will not stop until he achieves his goals. That's how dedicated he is to his craft. Tell us about Dusty Rhodes. 
It seems as though his popularity grows with each passing week. When you have two quality partners by your side, you have a tendency to walk with a little bit of a swagger. I think that's what we're seeing here. Oh, man. This guy's so popular, if he ran for president, he'd win in a landslide. Oh, boy. Then we'd be in some real trouble. Not going to win many matches with that move. If his back wasn't hurt before, it certainly is now. And it's going to be hurting for a while. Well, I've never seen him do that before. He's playing a wide range of offense here. Concentrating on the body here. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. Going for it again. Man, look at this. That's right. Just keep going. Repeat. Repeat. Not going to win many matches with that move. He looks a bit off his game here. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. And at this point, it looks to me like this match is as even as it could get. Well, it's hard to argue that, but I'd say this one could go either way. JBL in defensive mode here. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. My girl, we're going to see what this guy is made of. Yeah, well, at this point, he may want to think about finding a way to take a breather. Look at from the top. What an impact to the midsection. He's starting to stagger a bit. To be expected when you combine six of WWE's most volatile forces into one match. But it's important to know that this match has been so evenly contested so far. You really can't pick a winner. I think a lot of people would agree with that assessment, John. For his sake, I hope there's a lot more left in the tank. Tatsumi Fujinami smells blood. He better take advantage of this opportunity. And the boot connects with the abdomen. Just making his presence felt there. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top. Of Takes to the air. Wow. And that's why the adage holds true. There's a first time for everything. I think you're right. I believe that's the first time he's ever attempted. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. That's the first time tonight we've seen that move. I wouldn't mind seeing it a little more often. This guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Displaying a wide range of offense here. Dusty Rhodes is making his presence known. Yeah, isn't he? Oh, and he's been eliminated. <laughs> Dusty Rhodes doing some work with his striking here. Those shots are landing hard. Tatsumi Fujinami making contact there. <laughs> That'll leave him up. He's looking a little off balance. I don't think this is how he envisioned this match going here tonight. Don't count him out yet, Michael. I'd be shocked if this is the end of the road for him. Well, if there's one thing that I've learned from sitting here at ringside all these years, it's that you can never count a gamer out. And this guy, he's a gamer. Oh my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Oh, big time impact to the midsection. Look at this. Big E doing some good work here. He's in that six feet tall, 290 pound range, and is just a monster. I mean, Biggie's power and speed is a lethal combination that I don't know if we've ever seen the likes of before. 
You know what that means? It means fans know that when Big E is making his way to the ring, things are bound to get nasty in there. I mean, real nasty. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. WWE fans watching this match all around the world. We want to say hi to them, all the countries, even Manila, where I use their envelopes. Manila's not a country. This is still anyone's match to win. You're right about that, Cole. This thing is still up for grabs. Low. It's a, appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees the belt, he likes to hit below it. Looks like he's starting to falter. He came into this match looking for a fight, and it looks like he found one. Well, this might finally be where one of these guys starts to pull away. JBL turning the tables. This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. Hey, it's the WWE. It's not ballet. He knew this was going to be a battle, and that's exactly what we're witnessing. Oh, boy. Part of me thinks that he just doesn't have it tonight. And now it is show-off time. Don't waste time gloating here. Nicely executed. Oh, he missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah, we're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a goal. Keeping Big E in this match. He started this match in great health, but now it seems fatigue has set in. True, but when he used his finisher earlier, the entire arena thought this match was over, myself included. I don't know about you guys, but when he whipped out his finisher earlier, I thought this one was over. This is still anyone's match to win. You're right about that, Cole. This thing is still up for grabs. Wow, that was a wild strike. Talk about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. Who may have discovered his favorite move? My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. You're right about that, Cole. This has been an all-out war. And he gets out of the way. What an all-star ensemble in the ring right now. Six of WWE's most successful competitors for sure. You can see the wear and tear that this fight has taken out of these men. My, you're right. Such a brutal physical battle this has been. And it's not over yet. Nice reversal there. Good God. Is he pressing a secret button to move that fast? I mean, those kicks won't give you a good feeling. I can promise you that. JBL has been eliminated. Wow, what a win. Big E with the victory. Here's your winner, 
representing the New Day, Big E. Now that's eking out a win. Let's not overcomplicate things. This business is simple. It's all about wins and losses, and it sure looks to me like somebody has figured that out. Wow. Just wow. I'm speechless. What an amazing match.